So over the years we've had a real issue with uh, deer um, eating all the plants and flowers up at the main house. And this is where they normally come through, right here. So last year we used these detectors and it's called Deer Guard by Bird X. This one needs new batteries. They run on four um, C batteries. Got one there. And this one appears to be working. And normally they the deer would come up and just eat all these flowers and you know drink out of the bird bath, which is fine, whatever. And uh, we haven't had a problem since using these. These normally would be all eaten along with all these flowers too. So up here we also have uh, We've got one here that's working. And we've got one on the front right here that I just put batteries in. They would eat uh, a lot of the little hostas like this and all these flowers. So I'm recommending this product. Um, it works very well. What I did, I modified the product. It has these mount holes back here, but I went and got some of this uh, chain and some bolts and just mounted it to this back cover. This is the inside. You can run on AC and you can turn it off. There's a range and uh, you run it in DC right there, DC 9 volt thing. And um, this is like your levels of, you know, rodent, bats, cats, dogs, skunks, opossums, armadillos, raccoons, deer, insects. I just turned it all the way up. <clears throat> so batteries just pop out like this and there's tons of ants in here <clears throat> they're making a nest <laughs> look at these guys all right oh they just love this thing so maybe the ants get attracted to it <clears throat> and what does it say does it say insects but this might be flying incense insects it attracts ants in the back panel <clears throat> that's in the back the sensor is facing forward so <clears throat> we haven't had any problem with the deer this year or last year and um, normally I'd have to spray this stuff that just let's see this one might just be broken oh there we go a little bit of the it does make that sound. Hmm. Alright, this one might be starting to malfunction because of the ants inside. Whoa! Okay, there we go. Um, I don't want that thing to bite me, but... Um, yeah, I'd have to spray the stuff that really stunk. Sometimes I'd have to spray it before I'd have to stop at the store or something. It was like, dude... You know, so I recommend these for uh, keeping the deer away. Deer Guard by Birdax. First little cabin I built. It came as a kit. I did a whole video on it. Let's see what's inside of here now. I haven't been in, in a while. Yeah, the kids have their little, their little um, kitchen in there. The windows work, and I'm gonna bunch up there. I'm pretty good. Reminds me, I gotta clean these kayaks. I'm gonna use them this uh, this year. I didn't use them at all last year. Yeah, so this is my crazy car. Um, the lighter, I need to replace that. Lots well, of Oh, so we need, uh, lots of like these are like little uh, scraps and stuff from extra things, and whatever. Uh, sample stain, I gotta get that, and the wood, I gotta uh, do a fix a deck. Uh, some trim. This is a sample. I gotta wrap around a box, so got that with me. Uh, Kickstand for the XL250. I gotta find a piece of steel that I gotta find a better piece of steel that goes in that. Um, for the prototype I'm going to build electrical checkers extra these don't belong in here I already did that job it's done and uh, 
that's it. That's the bench top that I need the piece of steel for.